Turkish PM Ahmet Davutoglu has promised to boost security along the country's border with Syria, after 30 people were killed by a bomb in the town of Suyuk. Investigators think the blast was caused by a female suicide bomber from the Islamic State group. Correspondents say Turkey is cracking down on the militants, after previously being accused of ignoring them. But the blast triggered violent protest in Istanbul, with police using water cannon, tear gas and rubber bullets. Monday's bomb hit a group of youth activists planning to cross into Syria to help rebuild the town of Koban. A video shows the group holding a news conference to discuss their plans, when an explosion rips through the young people, mostly of university age, gathered in the grounds of a cultural center. They had been chanting slogans and were holding a large banner with the words We defended it together, we are building it together. Koban is just across the border from Suyuk and has been the site of fierce fighting between Is and Kurdish fighters. It was retaken by the Kurds in January. Suyuk houses many refugees who have fled the fighting in Koban. The attack took place just before noon local time, 9 o'clock GMT. Around a hundred people were injured. Mr. Devitoglu said initial findings suggested it was the work of Is. Turkey has taken and will continue to take all necessary measures against Islamic State, Mr. Devitoglu told a news conference in Ankara.